welcome back to my channel with the only one Sierra. If you are new here, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're not new here, welcome back. As you can see by the title, I'm going to be doing a fall boot collection because it's everything fall for like the next 20 days. I know I have not been the most consistent, but I'm working on it. I promise I am. I'm really, really working on it. I'm just in my lazy girl era and I'm trying to really get out of it. So please bear with me. Like I said, if you're watching this, please subscribe to my channel. We have reached, I don't even know how many subscribers, but I'm definitely blessed. And I just want to say thank you to everyone that has been watching my video, showing me support, and that has been subscribing. I really appreciate it because I give up easily. So I'm trying to not do that and get into just... I don't even know like how and explain it just like stretching it out and just promoting myself as much as possible basically believing in myself because i believe that that's what i lack and like and it's like hope and faith so i just need to start believing in myself and getting back to that okay so this is everything fall for like the next 30 days so i hope you guys enjoy this video stay tuned because they're gonna be maybe like boots that you guys have already seen but there's a lot of new boots in here so stay tuned for that and we're just about to get right into the video i have boots from all different types of places so yeah and then some of them i have links to and some of them i don't i will be adding links to all of the boots that i have links to in the description below so <laughs> My dog is staring at me. <laughs> She's like, who are you talking to? But um, I'm going to make sure that I put the description down below for everything that I have knowledge of where I got it from. Because I be just seeing stuff on the internet, thinking it's cute, and just ordering it. And not even knowing, like, where I got it from. So, yeah. So, we're just going to grab the first pair. I don't know off the top of my head. It says Cape Robin on the box, but I'm not, I don't think that's where I got them from. Um, like, I know I, I know I didn't get them from there. It was like some type of boutique, I believe. But, yeah, these boots are one of my new favorite boots. Um, they're not comfortable. I'm just going to throw that out there. I've seen a lot of girls wear these boots, and they're not comfortable. Um, but they are my favorite boot. Um, these I got these in a the size seven. And let's just look at the details. Probably won't be. Able, it probably won't focus. It's just focusing on me right now. But I just it gives classy rock star vibes. I think that's the reason why I like these boots. And I only wore them once. I wore them recently. I might put the pictures up here. Um, follow me on Instagram. All of that is going to be in the description below. All of my Instagram, TikTok, it, that's all the same. Only one Sierra. So make sure you guys follow me. I did take pictures in these. Um, they are really cute. They're not, they're not like the type of boot that looks weird on the side. Like it has that perfect curve. I'm going to show you. I'm going to have to compare these boots to a different boot to show you like the curve difference. Because it'd be looking, it's a difference like between cowgirl and just stylish fashion boots. So um i have a purse and i'm kind of sad because my friend stole my purse she knows she is if you're watching this video then you know i have a purse that looks just like these boots i bought these boots to go with that purse but when i decided to wear the boots i didn't have the purse and i wasn't about to go get the purse i couldn't even go get the purse because my friend was out of town and she probably had the purse with her so but these are the boots and i don't know if you guys watch my birthday vlog um I ordered these when I ordered these boots I actually showed you guys and I ordered two pair I am going to make a depop um so you guys can purchase this everything I put on there and I can is probably worn once or brand new but these boots I have in a size eight sitting in my closet I'm never going to wear them um if I don't sell them I end up giving them away so if you're interested in these boots I bought these boots for like $80. I can literally sell them for like 50, even though they were never worn. Not these, but the other pair. Even though they were never worn, I just need to get them out of my closet because I have a lot of unnecessary stuff in my closet that I don't even wear. 
but yeah so i will be making that real soon it's, that's the thing like i literally said in that video my birthday vlog which was back in april i said i was gonna make a deep pot and i never did i just hope the lazy girl era don't last forever because it's 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 starting to stress me out it's starting to stress me out like this video well i really just thought about this video so pat on the back for me but um these boots comfort wise i give them a four out of ten and then look wise definitely a 10 out of 10. i love like the strings on the side um i didn't tie them either when i wore them i think i put the pictures up so you guys can see but if i find where i got these from i will put the description down below so whew, the next pair I, I have some of these boots I have not even looked at in a long time. Like, I don't even know what these are. These are a size six. Okay, I remember these boots. God, y'all, like, I'd be in a mess. I am the type of person to, like, if I have an event to go to and I need an outfit, I'm going to order an outfit. Like, I'm not the type to ramble in my closet. Even though there's a lot of stuff in there I've never worn. I'm gonna order an outfit. Like I'm just that's a toxic trait of mine. But these boots, never worn these boots. These are from Shein, and I never worn these boots. And I just think they are so cute. But I can use these boots to compare what I was talking about to the old boot. So I mean, not the old boot, but the last boot. So as you can see, in this boot, it has like the perfect curve but this boot it just like goes like i don't know it looks i don't know it's cute like i really like these boots i don't know what i'm gonna wear them with i don't know when i'm gonna wear them but i'm gonna wear them this fall and i'm gonna make sure it's a really cute outfit i haven't even think i i haven't tried these on either they still have the paper inside i ordered these maybe like last fall and i have not worn them so that's how you know i buy shoes in the midst of the moment or something i see on the internet like an inspo outfit inspo yeah like i just bought a bunch of fall clothes which i will be doing a video with as well and i thought about a 10 i probably won't wear them until two fall seasons from now but or i might give them away <laughs> somebody just told me the other day that i buy clothes don't wear them and they give them away to my nieces but i mean yeah i mean everybody just keep them i mean I, I feel like stuff just be cute in the moment and then once you get it and you don't wear it it be worn out like the season is just over like not like the fall season but the season of that piece like i feel like boots are gonna stay in style for the next few years they just i feel like they just came in style like like a year or two ago back in style but they're gonna stay in style for the next few years so you can never have too many boots but like skirts and metallic and you know certain stuff is just gonna go out of style so it's like yeah but yeah these comfort wise i'm not sure because i have not worn them yet but look wise i give them a eight out of ten um, I just don't know how this is going to, the top part is fit around my leg. I don't know if it's going to be wide, like have a lot of room, or it's going to be fitted around my, around my leg. I don't know. But I prefer fitted. I don't know. That's just me. I prefer it to hug around my calf. Um, and yeah, I have a purse that matches these and everything, but I just haven't worn them, sadly. And I don't think I'm going to edit this video. I don't feel like I need to do too much editing. I might just do a couple cuts here and there, but I won't really need to edit. And I will have the description for these, I believe, <sighs> down below. Okay. What are these? Oh, my next pair. Okay, I know what these are. These are from Just Fab, as you guys can see on the box. 
I got these boots, I think, last year or the year before last during fall season. I only wore these boots once. But I'm not going to give them away. I might keep them. These are, like, thigh high. Oh, yeah, I'm definitely keeping these. These are, like, thigh high leather boots. Um, but I wore these. They were, like, comfortable, definitely. Um, I believe these boots were, like, around $50, $60. I meant to tell you guys, those sheen boots was maybe, like, $40. Um, they have, like, a zipper here. It's, like, a half zipper. Like, maybe, like, from, like, the ankle to maybe, like, mid-calf. And that's where... That's where you zip it up. I'm not really too much of a leather boot fan. As far as like flat boots, this is my first pair of flat leather boots. And when I bought these, like I said, they were in style. Everybody was wearing them. They were wearing the short ones, the medium size, like the knee length, and then the thigh length. And I decided to get the thigh length boots. And I really do like them, but I only wear them once because like I said, I don't really... I just be buying stuff. And sometimes I buy shoes. Sometimes I buy shoes with no outfits to go with them, and sometimes I buy outfits with no shoes. But that is what I do. So, yeah, I give these a 7 out of 10 now. Maybe like back when I first bought them, they would have been a 10 out of 10. But now they're a 7 out of 10, and comfort wise, 10 out of 10, because you can never go wrong with a flat shoe unless it's too small for you. And these are in a six and a half. And as you guys can see, I've done set like eight different sizes since we started. I'd be buying boots in different sizes, uh, just depending on the boot. Like if it's a flat boot, I might buy like a six or a six and a half. And if it's like a heel boot, definitely a seven, seven and a half because they're less comfortable. And then because of the curve, it's going to be tight. Like those black boots were definitely tight. Oh y'all, I'm out of breath. I don't know if it's just me, but yeah. My next pair, Ego Official. As you can see, this is from Ego Official. Um, never worn these boots. These boots were bought out of something I. These boots, I can admit. I saw something on the internet and it was like a cute outfit and I was like, okay, I need to get those boots. Never worn these boots. Don't think I'm going to wear these boots. So if you see these on my Depot, then just know that I never wore them. So whatever the price is, is what the price is. These boots I bought on sale for like $20, but they're retailing now for me. Well, they were having a sale when I bought them. So they were like $20, but the retail price was maybe like $60. I don't know. I might wear them. I don't know. But the, these boots are like a sock boot vibe. They are thigh length. Um, these are a size 6. I have never worn them. I tried them on, but I never actually wore them. So, yeah, I'm definitely... I feel like I'm... I think I'm going to wear them this year. I just got to find something that's like super cute that goes with them. Which I might have. I don't know. But oh, they are thigh length. They're like a cloth material. Stretchy as you can see. So like if you've got like a thicker um, calf muscle. Or even thighs period. I think these are perfect for thicker women for sure. Like I'm, I'm a little thick but I ain't thick. Like I ain't skinny but I ain't thick. If you get what I'm saying. Um. I just look like a skinny girl that gained some weight, basically. Um, the look of these shoes are definitely a 10 out of 10. They're so cute. They look like they can be very comfortable. Like I said, I just tried them on, so I didn't really wear them out. So I don't know if they're comfortable or not. But yeah, 10 out of 10 for the look for sure. And I think I'll be able to put the link down below for these as well. Um, the details are super cute. I love like the, the square um, heel. You just gotta start paying attention to details. The square heel is super cute. Love the vibes. I love how it's cloth. So like the best thing to do is probably wear a sweater if you're gonna wear like, if you're gonna wear 
whatever you decide to wear with the boots like these, it might have to match the material. Like, why would you wear a leather boot with no, I don't know. I can't even, like, it's like, your shoes have to complement the outfit. The outfit is not supposed to complement the shoe. The shoe is supposed to complement the outfit. So if I have on leather boots, I need to have either on a leather jacket or a leather purse. If I have on cloth boots, I need to have a cloth purse, cloth of jacket. It just makes sense. So definitely a 10 out of 10 for the look of these. Um, they could have been made a little bit better that I can't say. Like I can already see like some stitching that it's not going to focus. Yeah, look at the boots, 10 out of 10. The boot itself, I'm not sure because I have not worn them. Like I said, Ego Official, I'm sure they still have these. And also in these boots, they have like a size that stops like, it kind of, I'm gonna have to fold it. Kind of looks like this. It does look like this. Like it goes up about this much. Those are super cute too, but I could not debate on which ones I wanted, but I was just starting to get into my boot era back then, so I was like, okay, I might as well get the thigh high ones. But they do have some that stop like around here, which are super cute as well. These come in pink, I believe like a forest green, like a dark green, and then beige or tan, whichever way you want to say that. And then black, I think. But I went with pink because <laughs> I'm not a pink girl. It might look like i'm not a pink girl y'all growing up i was a purple girl i wore purple my favorite color is purple bedroom was purple like i was a purple girl not a pink girl so i don't have a lot of pink stuff so i've been trying to elevate my closet with different colors like yellow green pink blue other than black because i always got on black next what these are i've never worn these it might look like i've worn these but I moved three for, I've been moving every year. So that's probably why the box looks jacked up. But I've never worn these boots before. As you can see, they're from Fashion Nova. Um, the color is nude. It says it's a style. The style is jade. And it's just in a size six. And on Fashion Nova, if I can't find the link, I can tell you the name. It's called She's Going Places Ankle Boots. So these are ankle boots. Yeah, I've definitely. <laughs> what was I thinking about when I bought these boots? Okay, they're, they are kind of cute. Kind of. But like. I don't know. I mean, I feel like it'll be cute with like a um, cargo pants. So you can get these off. Like by like putting your pants over these. Um, but I don't know what I was thinking about when I bought them. Um, and I'm sure there's a reason behind it why I buy everything. I've probably seen them on the internet or saw a cute outfit inspiration. So, yeah. These boots, I don't know. I wonder if you could take the heel out and see what it looked like. Oh. <laughs> you could take the heel out of it. Oh, no, you can't. Because it's attached. It's attached like a sock. But as you can see, paper still in it. I've never worn these boots. They're cute though, but the, it is attached to the bottom. Maybe I could cut it off if I wanted to, but I'm not. Just going to keep it like this. Um, I've never worn these. The look, I give them a 6 out of 10. Um, I guess just depending on the outfit though. Like the outfit, like I said, can probably make the boots look better. I'm surprised these are even called boots, but okay. Um, like I said, it's like a sock material. These are way more stretchy. So I don't know how high they'll actually go up your leg without starting to come down. Because like I said, I never wore them. But yeah, I got these boots in a six and a half. And I don't know. I don't know how I feel about them. I don't really care for the circle heel at the bottom don't really care too much for that i don't really care too much for the cloth at the bottom either but i just like how it looks like without this I'm sure it'll be super cute so that's why i said maybe a cargo pants or maybe mom jeans or um boot cut jeans or whatever will look super cute with a pointed heel so yeah next yeah. 
next we got another boot from fashion nova you see the dust <laughs> you see the dust on these boots baby that's how you know i don't wear none of my clothes or shoes these are in a style vogue and they're black and they're in a size seven i think i know what these are but i'm not for sure okay yeah i bought these boots i was young when i bought these boots i'm surprised i even still have them yeah i wore these a couple times these are super cute they are comfortable um i probably won't wear them again you might see them on my depot only because i bought these boots a couple of years ago so i'm for sure well they're size seven i don't know i might be able to fit them but I don't know when I'll be wearing boots like these. Like, but these, like I said, cost me material. Might have to wear like a sweater or a button down or something with them. But yeah, the look of these boots, I give them a 7 out of 10. And for comfort, I'm not sure only because I don't remember. Because I only wore these once. So I don't really remember how they felt. But they do have the cloth on the bottom, which means that it probably helps with you know your heels because that's the only thing not even the heels the only thing that be hurting when i wear heels is like the bottom of my foot like right where the toes are that's where that's what be hurting like my actual heel don't hurt my actual like ankle don't hurt it's be like if you know you know no rough these are a size six and a half they are green and these are in the style levi's or Levis, I'm not sure. It looks like it could be Levi's because I'm sure this is how you spell Levi's. Yeah, nothing, nothing is going on. Focus. But these are one of my favorite boots only because of the color. Like I said, when I bought these boots, this was when I bought these boots, it was the beginning of me trying to expand the color of my wardrobe. Um, and if you watched my vlogs, of course, you would know that I wore these boots already for Sweetest Day. I re remember like it was yesterday. Definitely my favorite. These, honey, are my favorite. Like, I'm definitely going to be wearing these again. But they're so pretty. Like the color. Oh, Sierra inspired me with these boots because she has an outfit on her instagram page with the same boots on and i don't remember the outfit i think she had like a long green cardigan or a big old coat i don't know but i just like the color of the boots and i like the boots period my outfit looked nothing like hers i wore these with some ripped up jeans with a um green jean jacket green purse white bodysuit like it was just calm but cute i might put the pictures up there but the look of these boots i definitely give them a 10 out of 10 for comfort i give them a 6 out of 10 because they're not the most comfortable boots um like you could just tell you could tell i was scraping my feet across the concrete that's how much they were hurting plus i think they're six and a half they are. I should have got a seven. But like I said, boots with heels, I usually get a seven or a seven and a half because like I said, they will be tight. Like around here is where they will be tight. Like, yeah. So definitely a six out of ten for the comfort of these boots. But baby, if you're trying to like switch up your game and throw a little style in your wardrobe, you need these boots. You need these boots. And I will have the little link of these boots down below if not i think i said the name of these boots <sighs> these <laughs> look just like the black boots literally here let me uh compare let's compare gal because look there are girls out there that love shein i'm one of those girls love shein love the prices and then there's some girls out there that hate on shein but because of the prices i don't know but shein these are from shein these are from fashion nova same boot i'm sure just different colors same boot but different colors um i'm trying to see 
yeah i only wore these boots once um like i said they're the same boots so they're not really comfortable at all um and i don't think i had on the perfect outfit when i wore these boots i wore these boots with a sweater never it was a button down sweater at that i'm not doing that again i think i was just in a rush it didn't have nothing to wear but yeah these are from fashion Nova. i mean these are from shein these are from fashion Nova. so as you can see they're the same boot they look just the same and look at these just for something simple cute give them a nine out of ten and for comfort of course i will stick to the six out of ten just because they are the exact same boot and I don't have the box. I have the box of these, but I don't know where the box is. I might have thrown it away. But I have a lot of shoes. I have a lot of heels, boots. I only have like a few pair of sneakers, y'all. It might be hard to believe, but I only have a few pair of sneakers because I used to be a sneaker girl growing up all the time. I used to be a sneaker girl. Love sneakers, love Jordans. But I grew out of it. And recently just sold like 10 pair of Jordans. So... All I have is New Balances and maybe one pair of Dunks. And I got a few pair of New Balances. Like, that's it. I'm just in my comfort girl era. I'm not trying to be cute and uncomfortable. I already got to be cute and uncomfortable with the boots. I'm not trying to do it when I actually got on a comfortable outfit. So, that's why I'm like, okay, New Balances, Asics. Um, any shoes like that is what I'm going for these boots i wore on my birthday if you guys watch my birthday vlog then you know if you have not watched my birthday vlog go watch my birthday vlog like why are you even playing with yourself like that my birthday vlog was lit i went to go see future which is a random feature is and i wore these boots i got these boots from boutique i don't remember what it's called but i'm gonna look through my emails and try to find the link for you guys and yeah these boots are super duper cute i had a time in these boots as you can see i'm not going to sell these on depop because i'm definitely going to wear these again but the front is a little scuffy right here only because like i said i had a time in these boots and they're not comfortable at all they look super cute they are super cute but they are not comfortable at all the look of these boots definitely give it a 10 out of 10 but for the comfort i give them a 4 out of 10 they're very uncomfortable they're probably comfortable for the first 15 minutes that you're wearing them but after that that's it like there's there's that's it um i love like the ruffles I think that's what makes the boot. And I got a lot of compliments when I wore these boots. Like, everybody's like, oh my god, girl, your boots are so cute. I'm like, yeah. I got a lot of compliments wearing these boots. I actually have a Kurt Geiger purse that goes perfectly same material, same color. So yeah, you know I'm gonna wear these again. And I didn't I took pictures, but I didn't even post the pictures, so you know I'm gonna wear these again. Like, why even play with myself like that? But yeah, I love the ruffles, super cute details. I love these lines or like the stitching right here. Definitely makes the boot for sure. I love how the zipper is kind of like an off pink. Super cute. Okay. Last pair of boots. Not so out of 10, I got more coming in the mail, but this is my last pair. These are from Just Fab as well. Um, I wore these boots once for maybe 30 minutes. <laughs> I am sad, y'all. I don't know why. Um, these are what the boots look like. I think they're super cute. They're super cute. You can't tell me these are not cute. The only thing I don't like about these boots is how thick the sole is like it's too many layers we got a layer here and then a layer here and then the actual boot it's too much um so yeah these are like some heavy boots like these are like rain boots like if you like going to be cute don't put these on but if you're going to like be comfy on a rainy day you got a raincoat whatever then yeah because when i wore these boots for the first time i wore them with some leggings and a central hoodie so that's the type of vibe 
with these like these are like boots that will look cute with a pair of leggings don't matter what pair of leggings you put on these are not a jean type of boot these are leggings and i'm gonna see if i can tell you guys what these are called These are in the color Sandstorm, and they're called Flat Boots, Casita, whatever. And I got these in a six and a half. I don't remember if I can even fit them right now. I'm sure I can, but I don't remember how they feel. I think they were a little bit uncomfortable only because they were so heavy. Like, if you plan on running away, if you plan on doing something you shouldn't be doing, do not wear these boots because you're going to get caught up. Like, I wouldn't even wear these boots to go go no no uh but the look of these boots i definitely give them a eight out of ten so cute um i think i got these the same time i got the black ones but these are not thigh length the black ones are and these are not leather i don't know what these are but i'm sure they're waterproof but i don't think it's leather material it doesn't say but i don't think it's leather material and then this goes slightly under the knee like that as well i love that too so i needed a flat boot when i bought these these were in style just like when i bought the black ones and these are still in style to me it just depends on how you wear them but yes i love these boots love 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 that is it for my boot collection i hope you guys enjoyed this video i got way more videos to come so don't sleep on me don't Count me out, y'all. I got more videos, I swear. My lashes. I have more videos to come, so make sure you guys stay tuned. If you have not subscribed, by the end of this video, you need to be subscribing. Like, I don't understand. One thing I don't understand is how people can sit through a video and watch the whole video and not subscribe. But like, what's the point? Like, are you supporting or are you just watching? Like, are you just being nosy? That's what it's giving. So, yeah. Make sure you guys like this video comment your favorite pair and if you don't see the link to one of the video i mean one of the boots that i put in the video make sure you guys comment and i'll just tell you guys where i got them from i can try to find the name of the boots i'm going to do as much as i can as, as to finding where i got these boots from and the exact link to these boots like i said if you have any questions about any of the boots that i did not say like uh anything like Make sure you guys comment. I'm also open to helping out with outfits. Like if you need outfit inf inspirations or like outfit questions to wear with certain stuff, then just let me know as well. Again, I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching my video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Stay with the sister now. She got a man, but he out of time.